What is going on ladies and gentlemen, my name is Equal Espresso, and today we've got some information that may be a breakthrough in the Call of Duty Ghosts information world. And what I'm talking about is a character that may or may not appear in Call of Duty Ghosts campaign. Now I cannot take credit for this find, this is my good buddy Operation Craig, his channel will be in the description below and on the annotation on screen. He was the one that initially brought this to me and was like, hey, if you want to use this, go ahead, it's all cool. Um, but this information actually kind of blew my mind, and it's something that is very possible. Well, Call of Duty Ghosts may actually include our favorite character, Simon Ghost Riley. And now if you're like, Jordan, calm down here, what are you talking about? This, I mean by that, it wasn't anything straight up confirmed by Activision themselves or anything like that. But the voice actor that does Simon Ghost Riley, Craig Fairbass, his resume was updated with, in his filmography work, Call of Duty Ghost Lieutenant Simon Ghost Riley main character as his role. It was initially thought due to popular demand that Simon Ghost Riley would return, but possibly in a lesser role, which is actually something that's possible still because he was listed as air quote flashbacks yesterday, but it was changed to main character earlier today. So what I want to do today is tackle these ideas of Ghost being in Call of Duty Ghosts from multiple different angles. In Call of Duty Modern Warfare 2, Ghost is killed in the loose ends mission where you're trying to get away with Makarov's intel and then Shepard kills both Roach and Ghost. Now if there's no foul play in that and I mean that like nothing shady went down in a sub story or whatever that Ghost somehow lived, well I can see the fact that Ghost would be a cameo appearance in a flashback of sorts like where you would as a player be transported back into time reliving some moments in Ghost's past. This would be a perfect time for the quote that Robert Bulling made previously in regards to MW3 that Ghost isn't exactly dead but you'll see what I mean soon and that was something that was interpreted many different ways before MW3 came out and a lot of people were kind of confused about that but there was no Ghost that was actually in Modern Warfare 3. A lot of people thought maybe he'd be a little cameo segment, maybe a little easter egg, something like that. Well, as far as I'm concerned, Ghost was not in Modern Warfare 3. I played the campaign multiple times, and I played multiplayer for many, many hours, and I saw no traces of Ghost. Well, maybe I'm missing something, maybe I'm not, but this would be a perfect time to introduce any retro throwbacks to Simon Ghost Riley's past if they're going to do a flashback type thing. Now, the other side of this could be a loophole in the death of Ghost or something before his death itself. Well, if that were the case, well then I would imagine Call of Duty Ghost to be around the same time frame as Call of Duty Modern Warfare 3 where the trilogy finishes up. And if this is the case, the side missions that we do Ghost could be a main character, he could be realistically one of the focus points of the game itself in which we're telling a story of Ghost and his colleagues in this Spec Ops team. Now none of this should actually take away from the fact that this game is going to be based off of multiple characters, six characters as we're led to believe, Ghost is not the main character or the center focal point, it is the group as a whole, the Spec Ops team that we're going to be focusing on. So the main debate point is whether or not Ghost is actually going to be a Call of Duty Ghost main character, or if he is going to be a cameo character type thing where we do flashbacks just to where there are little pieces and bits of the story to tell with him in it. Only time will tell, but with the recent information that's been not leaked per se, but rather put out there that Craig Fairbrass was actually in fact working with Call of Duty Ghosts and Activision and Infinity Ward for the title. So whether or not this is just some giant wiki troll or something like that, I don't know, but this kind of confirms to me that Ghost will have some part in Call of Duty Ghosts. Whether it is something big or something small, that's the debate as of now on my plate. But that has been my time, ladies and gentlemen. Thank you guys so much. My name has been Ecola Espresso. Remember to share to your Facebook, Twitter, and or MySpace if you're OG like that. Help out tremendously and are greatly appreciated. All comments, likes, and other feedback like that, I always love to hear. So be sure to stay tuned for my channel. I'm going to be bringing you guys the best and the newest in Call of Duty Ghost information as I get it and get it to you guys as quickly as I can. So thank you guys so much again. I hope you guys are having a great day and peace out.